Hi friends, this is Subrat here and in this video we are going to discuss about Pandas each and a method. So let's start. So I'll explain you with one example so it will be easier to understand. In real life scenario, we'll be having lot of missing values in our data set. So we need to identify where my missing values are present. Then we can treat those missing values perfectly. So for that reason, I can use my each and a method to identify wherever my missing value is present suppose this is my uh, demo data frame called df and i have some columns like this id gender country and pin so in my country column i have some nn values so here nn stands for not a number that means wherever the missing values are present that means if the user is not giving its gender or country then it is going to substitute it by the nn value so we need to identify where these nn values are present so i can use the pandas each and a method to identify where my nn values is present so if you are using like this pd dot each and a and you are passing the data frame as an argument then you will see the output like this so wherever the nn values are present then you will get a true as its replacement and wherever the non nn values are present here it's false so it is asking wh whether my data frame contains each na if it's satisfying then it is putting true or else it is putting false over here so one more way you can use you can directly call this each na method upon data frame object so here i have called by using the pandas library so directly also i can call df dot each na you will get the same result as an output so let us see the second example suppose this is my index and here i have one missing value here non nn values are considered as the missing value suppose you are printing the index like this then you will see the output nat so if you are passing pd dot e na and as an argument if you are passing index then you will get true here as an output because this nat is considered as my missing value so let us see one more example suppose this is my data frame called df and i have a missing value called non so non is also considered as the missing value if you are putting this data frame inside a egna method then you will get output like this format here the non has been substituted with a true value so in this way you can identify wherever my missing values are present by using the each and a method so each and a method is returning me a boolean type data type so if you are putting input as a scalar then you will get a scalar boolean for array input return as an array boolean so if you are putting a data frame then you will get a data frame object as an output so based on the input type it will return you the data types so friends this is all about how i can use the each and a method to identify wherever my na values are present i hope this concept is clear if you guys have any doubt regarding this you can leave a comment under my video thank you